so, oops. Um, <laughs> anyways, um, good morning. So, I uh, woke up about an hour or so ago and got down to the office and started editing my vlog. So the older vlog is obviously being uploaded and I am starting off my day. But how to start off my day? Best thing, have some granola. It's gonna be most of a relaxed day and then obviously hit the gym and then come back home. Um, to be very honest, I'm hella sore from yesterday and I don't know how today's gonna happen, but I will make it happen. So for my second meal of the day, I'm gonna be having two veggie patties. I'm gonna put a little bit of ketchup on it and that's about it. So yeah, eating healthy. So I just had the best nap ever for like the last like two, two and a half hours. Um, yeah, I was just laying on the couch and like the sun was shining in and I was like, okay. I'm very tired and my back is extremely sore from yesterday. So I'm like, okay, I'll take a nap. And a half an hour nap turned into like a two and a half hour nap, which is okay. But anyways, I'm on to, uh, sorry. Now I'm uh, heading out for my next meeting. Uh, I'm actually meeting my old middle school teacher. I would say he was my grade seven teacher and he just wanted to kind of, you know, meet up, catch up and stuff. So I'm gonna meet up with him. But obviously before I go, I need to have my third meal of the day. So trusty Vega bar for now. So I just had the best meeting and catch-up session with uh, my teacher, Mr. E, and it's it's hilarious because we're just like obviously reminiscing for like back in the days. Oh, I remember in grade seven we did this, we did that. Like he was the only teacher in our school who had an arcade video game system in his classroom, and we used to play that all the time. Our break time, our lunch time, that's it. We used to play all the time, and he was like a fun guy. We like made our classroom into like. A performing arts theater type thing and we did like a lot of you know plays over there and we never even took it down he still has that stage which is amazing because i think i was like i don't even know how old i was but i think it was like back in the year 2000 or something like that but yeah it was just great then this is what i like life is too short to be upset and to like not enjoy yourself so what do i do i actually go and i just meet older people that i have you know haven't talked to in years and it's just great reconnecting is the best thing ever so Live life and enjoy life. So I actually never come to the gym late ever because I'm not a big fan of coming to Surrey <laughs> later on in the day and I usually always have a lot of other work to do. But the reason I'm here tonight is because, uh, what's his name? My trainer, Romeo, he's going to be going on vacation for 10 days and today was the last day I can work out with him and daytime wasn't working. So I thought, okay, evening does better. So here I am. So I'm just heading home from uh, a client's place. Um, yeah, I had a late night workout session and then ended up meeting up with a client just because I was like, okay, if I'm already in the city, um, might as well just uh, get this meeting done and over with. But I made a mistake. They ordered pizza and they offered, and first I was like, no, I'm okay. But I was very hungry and unfortunately I did not have any of my protein bars on me to kind of control my hunger and unfortunately I had three slices of pizza that is very bad and goddamn like I, I don't know how to control this you know this thing over me like I don't know what it is especially with like eating junk food I guess because I haven't eaten it in a long time I'm so like addicted and it's it's hard to kind of say no, especially like when it's just there. Um, it's a different story if I went out of my way to grab pizza, but since it was just there, I don't know, I guess it seems like my body was able to kind of crumble under the pressure. Anyways, um, if you guys can support me and assist me and tell me how I could avoid cheating and avoid um, letting my hunger get the best of me, I would really appreciate any any other support that you have or any suggestions that you may may or may not have. So yeah, uh, my cravings are getting worse. 
I know I'm already like 35 plus days into it, but my cravings are getting worse and I, I don't know how to handle it right now. So if you guys could somehow, if, some, if any one of you has any suggestions or any, yeah, just any suggestions at all, I, I would really appreciate that. Because I don't really want to start gaining weight, I really want to lose weight, but it's just getting harder and harder and I just, I don't know what to do. And then obviously when I get upset, what do I really do? I usually just eat and I don't want to do that and that happens, but I just, I don't know how else to figure this out. So, yeah, but I, I don't want to, I don't want to give up hope and I don't want to go back to my normal ways. I gotta say, stepping out of the gym right now is the best feeling ever. The sky is beautiful. The weather is great. I'm not feeling cold at all. It's not too hot, it's just, it's perfect right now. Anyways, let's see what I do next. So all I did at the gym today 